This is Mr. Fernandez, and um, I'm sorry that I cannot be with you today. Um, but I want to do a quick tutorial about today's uh, playlist and what you have to do, okay? So watch this attentively. Um, we always start with Google Classroom. So I'm going to go to Social Studies, Yellow Class, which are you guys. And then after here, I'm going to go to Classwork, and I create a playlist. Go to Europe. And then you open the first one, which is a playlist. Once you click here, you have the playlist for today. And are here are all the assignments. Uh, it's about Brexit, immigration crisis, and the European Union. So you start with this at Puzzle. Um, that's the first thing that you have to do. You click, you, you know how to do it, Puzzle. Um, click there, and the video opens. You start watching, and then you can see at the bottom you have the questions. Answer all, and when you're done, submit. So that's uh, task number one. Um, the second one will be this one here, watch video two. So you got another video to watch in this one. And this one, you just watch it attentively. You can open a second window. And then, you know, uh, you have to go to this document and then answer the questions and submit. You have here, this is the video. These are the questions. You have your own document. And then question one, two, three, and four. And please answer, answer in full sentences here. And then you submit. Then after that, you know, if you finish that quickly, you can take a break. That's fine. You know, you always finish at 2.30. Break 10 minutes. You know, 10 minutes, we go from 2.30 to 2.40. Uh, always report to your teacher. That's very important before you take a break or anything. But if you don't finish, you can continue working after with that assignment. So the second part is start at 2.40. You watch this video. You don't have to do anything. Just watch the video. Uh, it's an animation. and talks about the immigration crisis. And when you finish, you're going to actually go to this place, which is called lucify.com. And I'm going to show you how to operate it and then answer the questions in this page. OK? Here are the questions, flow of immigrants. But you know how to, you have to know how to use the place. So super quick, I'm going to go here. It's very simple. You click lucify.com and it shows you the flow of immigrants in Europe. So when you got here, let it load and then you go here down. Now look at this carefully. On the top, when I move, this is a timeline. If I put it here, it goes by date. If I leave it like that, it keeps moving. Can you see? 30 May 2013, I can move it to, to different dates. This pick here is uh, 7th, 9th, 10th of October 2016. So you can move the timeline here. And as you move that timeline there, this map shows clearly. This is incredible. It's the flow of refugees. So if I want to see how was the situation in Europe in, let's say, December 2014, so I leave that mark here and then move my cursor down. Now look at carefully, when I hover over the countries, it shows me a number that is changing. The line is moving because time is passing. It says that minus 74,000. So, and then shows me the countries that are receiving refugees from Europe. Every dot that is leaving is like 100 people. So a tons of people are leaving. Okay, so you have here, and then you can change, and you, for example, I put it over here, which is the major crisis, and look at this carefully, okay, and I go to Syria, look at the amount of refugees that are escaping from there, you can hear, and you can see also the destination of these countries, isn't it, what, for example, I put from Libya, and they show you from where they are going. So it's very interesting because it points into which country we're going in Europe. Now, you have to answer different questions. And when you move the, the date, if you want to hear, you can see the totals. For example, Germany. Can you see? These bars show the amount. And at the bottom shows here 1,380,000 refugees by this time. So combine, combining between moving the timeline here and hover over the countries and seeing the numbers moving. Leave it in one country so you can see what happens in it. How many countries from Syria, or Iran, Turkey, and then you always refer to the timeline here. 
say Ukraine, and then you can have the, the countries that are receiving. So play with this, and you can see the numbers and the timeline there. That should be how you work with Lucify and try to answer the, um, the questions on this chart. It's all about using lucify.com, the flow of immigrants, and you have the questions here. Okay, that's how it works. Hopefully you can finish those assignments. If you don't finish, it will be homework. Okay, so try to do as much as you can. Okay, good luck.